My name is Bernard Warner, I'm the Commodore of Cunard Line uh, and I'm here with the three ships of the line in port for the first time together. The Queen Elizabeth, the Queen Victoria and the Queen Mary II. This ship uh, was launched uh, in October by Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II uh, at a great ceremony in Southampton. Uh, and since then she's been sailing for very nearly three months and this will be her maiden world voyage which she sets out on tonight. So a lot of excitement about that. Queen Elizabeth has uh, 12 decks. Uh, those are the main guest deck areas, I should say. We also have uh, a multitude of different public rooms and a lot of the iconic rooms that you would expect with Cunard. So, for example, we, uh, Cunard are the only company to actually have ballrooms at sea. I think the thing that people really enjoy was when they first walk down the gangway is that they see this magnificent grand lobby. It's three decks high. It's uh, got a piece of marquetry which was actually designed by Lord Linley, who is the uh, Queen's nephew. And there's also, of course, uh, a very important picture which was painted by Isabel Peachy, and that is of Her Majesty the Queen, who, as you know, actually named uh, Queen Elizabeth back in October. Well, on Queen Elizabeth, we have a lot of the elements that guests would expect on a Cunard liner, such as the Queen's Room, uh, a lot of rich decor, the uh, individually designed venues, uh, such as our Commodore Club. We also have our new Garden Lounge as well, which is a beautiful lounge, giving you the feeling of Kew Gardens in uh, London and probably one of the pearl in the shell uh, ideas here on board Queen Elizabeth is our Royal Court Theatre which is an 800 seater theatre and it really uh, gives you that feeling of a Broadway traditional theatre with theatre boxes. Uh, the ship itself, we are just three months old. We were built in Italy, a place called Montalcone near Trieste, and we spent our maiden season in the Mediterranean. Then we went across to the Caribbean for our first Christmas and have now just begun our maiden world voyage.